I can't even say that they're 419 because you know what? They're not 419. They're just rogues. Like, I can't even believe they tried this. This is how we making wigs in 2020. Hey guys, it's your girl Taya back here with another video. And today I am going to be doing a little bit of a story time for you guys. So before we go ahead and jump right into it, because I have a lot to cover. So let's just go ahead and dive right into the video. If you guys haven't already done so, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, all of that good stuff that I tell you guys to do at the beginning of each and every one of my videos. And let's just go ahead and get started. As you guys can probably already tell by my shirt, seriously, yes. I just thought this sweatshirt was super, super appropriate for today's video. And I don't even know where I want to start. But I think what I'm going to do is just go ahead and just share my experience, what happened to me, and just go ahead and just tell you guys about <laughs> um, what happened. So I used to do weaves a lot back in the day. Um, if I can find a pic, I'll go ahead and insert it, um, a clip or a picture of me with my weaves, how I used to like to rock my hair back in the day before I actually started experimenting, playing around, getting into my natural hair. So I've always had a love for hair. I've always had a love for units, wigs, all those things. Well, I didn't really like wigs, but I definitely always loved hair. So I decided that, you know what, okay, the hair industry has definitely come a long way since I was doing my little clips and all those, and all those different things. So I was like, okay, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and get into it. I wanna start doing color. I'm thinking like maybe not so much like wearing them because I still have my natural hair channel and I definitely wanna continue to promote my natural hair. But hey, why not just have some protective styles in the form of units, wigs, whatever. Yeah, I was laid in bed one night. I saw a little promo come up on um, Instagram. I clicked on the link. I was like, all right, bet, cool. This actually might be the perfect time, man. Like, should I go ahead and buy some? Like, it looks like it's a great deal. It was like 80% off of the units. And I was like, all right, cool. So I hit my girl up. I was like, girl, this, this, this look like a deal. What you think? So I sent her the link and I was like, look at the hair, look at this unit. Tell me what you think and let me know should i do it she's like yeah go ahead girl you don't never really you know splurge like that you real you know you real you you manage your your money well like that's one thing people know about me like i don't be playing <laughs> like i am um, like when it comes to certain things like i don't be playing so i was like all right cool go ahead and treat myself um Go ahead and treat myself long story short ended up ordering it they had like a little special buy one no buy two get one free so i was like all right cool if i'm already gonna spend thirty dollars for the unit let me just go ahead and mind you these units were not thirty dollars they were like a hundred or something but with the 80 to 90 percent off special they were wanting supposedly one day special they were like 20 30 dollars those type of in that range so i was like all right well i'm gonna see the first one i wanted was like 27 dollars, and i'll go ahead and just insert some pictures so you guys can see what's going on so i wanted them to both be kind of like curly but i wanted a long curly wig and then i also wanted a short kind of bob wig that i could wear like to work as a protective style when I'm going to work, I can put it in a ponytail. I can wear it, you know, maybe flat iron in a bob when I'm going to do like my trade shows and my little events and things like that because I do events pretty um, full time. So long story short, because this is beginning to be a very long story at this point. <laughs> long story short, I ended up ordering the, I ended up going with the sale, the buy two, get one free. So got an email, everything seemed like it went fine, went through PayPal. All that good stuff, bing, bong, bang, boom, whatever, ordered it. Got home one day and I was like, okay, so the package looked kind of, I was like, is that package for me? I'm going back for my mom like, hey, mommy, is that mine? Is that yours? And she's like, I don't know. And I'm like, okay, cool. So I get to the door, I saw a package, a little gray package like this. And I'm trying to figure out, well, my, my hair couldn't possibly be in that little bag because house way like the bag is little the units that i ordered were like full like i'm ordering like 180 density you know one long i ended up ordering two longs and one short so i'm thinking like okay these this bag is going to be a full bag because of the units that are in it girl you know you're excited you know how you be when you first get a new package like who doesn't love getting new packages like yes so excited 
ran in the house, got to the, the um, opened up my little package, and lo and behold, let me just get into what I saw inside. We've already established that I said I ordered two long hair uh, wigs, and then I ordered a short bob looking wig. So when I opened the package, I'm like, first of all, what is this? Why does the packaging even look like this? This is already an issue for me. Like, I know when I open or when I watch unboxings, I'm expecting some cute little pretty packaging. Okay, like, you know, pink, whatever. Like a wig bag, something cute that your unit is supposed to be stored in. Normally when you order, especially if they're like hundreds of dollar units. Like, if they're saying that these units are originally $150, $160, $70, I wouldn't expect for you to put my hair in this type of bag. That's number one. That's already freaking me out that I'm like, why is this thing in this little packaging, like a little Ziploc bag? So this is number two. I go in, I see this, I'm like, what is this? What What is this? Like, whose hair color is this? And why would I order, and I'ma just show y'all, what it's supposed to look like, what I ordered. This is what I ordered. And this is what came. I'm like, oh, so we doing Ziploc bag hair. So this is what I'm supposed to store my unit in. Okay, all right, so this is the unit. Now it has like a hairnet around it. And I mean, the hairnet is real thin, y'all. Like, real thin. Like, this this is what came in the package. Hairnet. <laughs> and, oh, okay. Don't want to let go of my hand. All right. And then, I guess, some paper. I don't know. I'm trying to figure this out. This is what came in the mail. Now, I just want y'all to see. And I don't know if I need to leave back the camera up a little bit more. Can y'all see this? What is this? <laughs> what is this? Like, and I don't even know if the camera is doing it any justice if we're picking up on it. Like if it's picking up what I'm seeing. First of all, let's just go into the inside. This is not a lace front. Let's just talk about it. And then I'm trying to figure out, I'm chocolate. What is this? Why? And then look at the stitching. Whose scalp color is this? This is unit number two. Now, what color is this? Somebody please tell me, what the heck is this supposed to be? What is this? Look at the bottom. Again, with this Honestly, it looks like they sent me two of the exact same wigs. Look at, this one is even worse. Is where Where is the lace? What is this? What is this net thing in the hair? What? Then they got the nerve to have a tag? What? Why? Why would they do this, y'all? Like, this is not, look at this. So this is supposed to be the lace front that they sent me. There is no lace, just a wig. And last but not least, Goldilocks over here, cause I don't know whose color, whose hair color this is. Um, know what to say to y'all like <laughs> I'm just so beloved like can somebody please tell me what this is supposed to be like why where am I going and who am I supposed to be in this hair and then look at the front look at the scalp how sway why would I order this cup Okay, we are gonna take this off. I don't. I don't even know what to say. I don't. <laughs> I don't know what to say. I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna just keep moving. I'm gonna just keep it moving. All 
all right <laughs> moving right along y'all like what is this supposed to be they tried it you guys they more than tried it like why though why did they do this to me <laughs> i don't know like what is this? is this a costume wig you guys seriously what is this y'all what like you can't even do nothing this is hor. look at the y'all look at the tracks Look at the track. Y'all see my face? Okay. I can't even run my fingers through it. This joint is so synthetic and so why did they even ask for the density? What was the part, like, what was the purpose? Please, somebody tell me. I don't understand. I don't understand, yo. What was the purpose of me taking my time going online just to order a wig that, this This is the track, y'all. This is, this is how the wig is made. Look at this. So if I wanted to part it, this is supposed to be a, oh, this is, this is the wig, y'all. If I wanted to part it, this is what you're going to get. Am I supposed to go outside like this? I just want you guys to see how, like, I don't even know if y'all understand how I'm feeling right now. This is how we making wigs in 2020. Okay, you guys, so these people are not 419. I can't even call them 419. I'm gonna just go ahead and say that they are rogues because 419 is a term that we use in Niger culture and that would just be giving them too much credit. I can't even say that they're 419 because you know what? They're not 419, they're just rogues. Like I can't even believe they tried this. I just wanted to go ahead and share this story with you guys. Comment down below if you guys have ever had a situation like this. What do you think I should do? Just tell me what you guys think I should do. I I don't know. What do you guys think I should do? Just tell me what you think I should do. And <laughs> I mean, I don't know, you guys. I really just wanted to share my story time with you guys. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Um, and I will talk to you guys in the next one. You guys know what to do. Stay blessed and...